Epic Escapes. Hello, awesome people of the world! We've got a double lane top, hopefully in a normal game though, because dragon dominance is important. Janna slows Volley Bear, but he quickly grabs Corky, and Lulu launches her delicious purple libations on top of Janna's shield. Corky is taking immense damage. Lulu lays her target for another Kool Aid splash, but Corky was hiding a Valkyrie up his sleeve all along. She instead hits Janna, taking tower damage, and a Zephyr with a tactical shield launched a little late. Now everything has seemed to calm down. The enemies are pushing in on this turret with a Jonna shield and a reaction in Corky's mind. Oh shit, I'm biscuits. No! Jonna slows Volley, but it's not enough, and Lulu laminates that purple goo all over the UTT kill. Jonna notices an escape route and flashes towards it, and now the lonely Lulu master of the late cools joins the pursuit. A loony Lulu flashes in after Jonna with boots in an attempt to catch her, but that's not happening. Jonna shields herself from tower damage and probably has three stacks on her shield instead of getting one Q, which obviously saved her from one more tower hit. Ezreal blinks in over the wall onto Lulu as a distraction, but Jonna encounters a graves in the jungle shields, slows, and ults Graves away, who did help Janna there by using his dash, but still, what a great play on Janna's part. She's gonna continue running, coming around to the mid turret, already a long ways from the top tower. She shields herself once again, taking two tower hits, moving on into the bottom jungle, where she's clear on Shaka, who just died to Talon. She's going to find a nice spot in the tri bush to blue pill now. The tension heightens with the sighting of Graves, who is now checking the bush. Janna zephyrs, shields, and starts running for her life again, as if she hasn't done that already. Graves dashes in, but does not land a single auto attack against Janna's health. He's gonna use his shotgun, but Janna is already too far away. Talon is quickly approaching and launches onto the pursuer, using all of his spells to eradicate the final threat to our Janna, who successfully liberated herself from the cold, groping hands of all the perverts who tried getting their share of Janna's booty. On the previous question, I personally don't have a favorite movie because I've seen so many and I love so many, although I'm pretty excited about The Hobbit. It's my favorite book from the Lord of the Rings saga. Leave the cannoli! I need to see the Avengers, I do. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes? I got one for you. Look up Banks Killing. It's about a satanic serial killer turkey. So funny. I haven't seen the new American Pie yet. I want to. Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy was so underrated. I wish they would make more movies. They are so funny in the books. When I was younger, I went to Montana, and I was in the middle of this large pond, small lake, and an unknown creature rammed my wooden rowboat. I literally about pissed myself, and I rowed as fast as I could with the group that was in the boat with me back to shore. I've also seen a legless midget who walked on his hands. Now that I've shared something weird with you, I hope you share some of your weird experiences with me. Now remember to click that like button please, and don't forget to subscribe and come back every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for more episodes. My name is Jerry. Swoosh! Make sure you remember to subscribe. You see that big yellow button down there? If you click it, you'll be updated constantly with our videos. So make sure you, make sure you, make sure you remember to click that yellow button down there and subscribe.